Hey guys, welcome to this channel. Here we animate 3D assets uh, for games. We use Pine 4.0 version. And today we are in the third video from the series where we animate Sun. We use uh, pre-made sequences from RTFX library. And uh, today we will be looking how I did the final polishing, added some more uh, effects and added also background. So let's see what I've done so far. In this part I have added six new effects. Uh, top three ones are uh, just keyframes, nothing special, no modifications. And bottom ones are modified using uh, linked mesh and mesh deform and binding to bones and deforming uh, using bones with weights. So. Let's see each of them in action. Let's start from explosion. You can see that three frame animation also is rotating using bones, just very simple. The flow is uh, animating along these bones. It's bound to these bones. And let's see that animation, which one we use, this one. Let's check the other animation. This is the particle along the background, like to give it a little bit more dynamism. Uh, narrow particles would be the surrounding particles of the sun, just moving in a wavy motion. Very unnatural, of course. Looking nothing like sun. But I have added more effects just to showcase more techniques, I don't know, more use cases. And the path would be this effect just flowing along these paths. Um, I have bones constrained to this path that bones control this mesh. So at the end we have scaled them, those bones. We, we could have like some flow in perspective. And the slash animation would be those fires appearing three times on the surface of the sun. Okay, let's combine them and see all of them in action. For that, uh, I will use a preview window because our animations are uh, different lengths. And uh, to show them in a loop, in a seamless loop, I will need tracks. And at the first, we have four tracks and each track can be played in its separate loop. So let's start adding them at zero frame, a zero track, I will add sphere, which we had done in previous videos. And I will start adding more effects on the next tracks. I think I need this one, right? No, this one. Let's go and add more whenever we add the last track. More tracks are being available. We will add the path and wait to load these effects. And last effect would be the slash, the fire that appears. I don't see it actually, it's not noticeable. But it's there, I'm definitely sure it's there. Yeah, we have combined all effects and uh, I think I will be closing this series and next we'll be doing 3D turn of the face using 4.0 version of Spine. Also, I am going to share this project. It's going to be huge because I haven't optimized images, meshes. I just did quick uh, projects to show you techniques that I use mostly when I work with VFX. I think I covered all techniques and if I miss something, I will come up and add it in this playlist. So make sure you, you have watched all the videos from the playlist if you are interested how uh, VFX are done in Spine. And uh, subscribe if you want to see next videos and if you want to support this channel, just share this video in social media so other animators will find it easily. Okay, bye guys.